I had the privilege of working with Miss Lauren Ashurst for seven months here at Indiana Junior High School as her cooperating teacher. And I can tell you that the thing that struck me about her first was how natural she was with students. Um, just the warm rapport that she had with students. Uh, we'd be walking down the hall and she would see one of our students and she would just go up if they needed help. She's nice, she's funny, she's easy to talk to. She was um, funny, helpful, just in general. The other thing I learned very quickly is, is what a quick learner Miss Ashurst has been. She's very good at listening. I documented all kinds of examples of ways that Miss Ashurst uh, demonstrated excellence in teaching. She's truly an exceptional teacher candidate. Let's move on our reading. Put your finger on the U. Colleagues of mine would come up to me and say, wow, you've got such a great student teacher. And part of it is she was here for seven months. That gave her really valuable experience. By the time Lauren was done, I saw her being able to write her own IEPs completely independently. I would look over her shoulder, I would look over the IEPs after she was done, but she was writing IEPs completely on her own. She was facilitating portions of IEP meetings. She was doing this like a seasoned professional. I've told many of my colleagues that any district that hires Ms. Asher is going to be getting one of the greatest bargains of the century. They're going to get a first year teacher that's way beyond a first year teacher. Ms. Ashurst learned to use the self-regulated strategy development model of teaching writing. She would use graphic organizers, she used rubrics, she used things to be able to get baseline data and measure students. And during her time here, as she taught these students writing, we saw dramatic increases in their skill level and their, their percentages in terms of proficiency on these rubrics. I think she'll be a great teacher and I learned a lot from her about writing. Ms. Asher's got experience not only teaching, but she was developing high quality literacy instruction. Uh, basically going out and finding her own materials, using articles uh, that could be differentiated to various reading levels. Um, she'd find out things the students were interested in and she would go find an article and make a guided reading sheet and do some close reading. She developed her own text-dependent analysis prompts based on articles and taught them how to do text-dependent analysis writing, argumentative writing, narrative writing, informational writing. Uh, she became really highly skilled at connecting text to students' lives. And I watched students who were disengaged become engaged learners. Um, she would bring in video clips and all kinds of creative ideas really master teacher quality stuff that I saw. And what was your favorite thing we did in class? We like, I like the article about the concussions. Miss Ashurst, how I will miss you. I've so enjoyed working with you. You've done a fantastic job showing me techniques that I can incorporate into my classroom. Always been able to count on you and your sense of humor and your incredible patience. I wish you every success and we will miss you very much. I love her sense of enthusiasm and she's just a bright spot in my day. She comes in with a smile on her face no matter how hard her day's been. The kids love her. Um, she has a great sense of humor too and we laugh together every day. I really love that. She's really funny. She was really funny too. She told a lot of jokes and she made the whole class laugh. Hey Lauren, it's Krista. We came in at the same time in the same year and you're very special to me. Um, I saw potential in you from the start. Mr. Weaver spoke about you, but I saw you in action. I'm absolutely excited to see in 10 years from now where you'll be and what you'll be doing, and I know you will have impacted hundreds of students' lives and parents and colleagues. So I'm excited about that, and I hope that we always keep in touch, and I'll always remember this year and I'm so happy that we got to work together for as long as we did, because that's rare. So here's to your authentic self, stay true to you, and remember these days, because you take this with you and that makes you a leader. Take with you how student-centered you are, because that is exactly why you're doing this. Lauren, I just want to wish you the very best as you embark on the next phase of your teaching career. I think what I appreciate about you most is the day-to-day -day way that you handle yourself. Um, watching you interact with kids, watching the way uh, you are completely engaged, not only with Mr. Weaver, but even 
in our study groups when we had the student teachers all come together and talk about important issues. Um, you handled yourself with grace and the dignity of a seasoned professional. So I really think that that's uh, what's outstanding about you. I have to add, I don't know that I've ever heard um, so many unsolicited, glowing remarks that are specific about the way you interact with kids like I have heard about yours. Comments that people have made to me about you working with students. And you'll know who I'm thinking of uh, when I say this. Mrs. Savagian has shared with me about some of the personal contact you've made with students. I think that really separates you because that's exactly the type of people that education needs. Um, people who make personal connections with kids, take the time to get to know kids, and really support them and meet them where they are. That goes beyond standards, it goes beyond testing uh, regimens, it's really getting to know the individual. And you're a genuine uh, star on the rise because you seem to get that already and um, I commend you for the work that you've done here. Um, you've impressed people that have my highest respect and admiration, Mr. Weaver being one of them and um, when you impress people like that, that really says a huge, huge compliment about you. So thank you for being here, thank you for being committed to our students and um, good luck to you. I'm going to miss her and she's going to make a really good teacher. We love you, Miss Asher's best wishes!